I'm Dr. Jacob Dunn. I'm reader in evolutionary biology at Anglia Ruskin University and I'm the director of the Behavioural Ecology Research Group. In this large-scale collaborative study we examine the evolution of the larynx amongst mammals. The larynx is a really important organ because it has evolved for three key functions in biology. The first is protecting the airways during feeding. The second is regulating the supply of air to and from the lungs. Um, and the third is for vocal communication. And there are therefore expected to be very strong evolutionary pressures acting on the anatomy of the larynx, um, perhaps particularly in those species with highly developed vocal communication systems. We created a novel database of digitally modelled larynges from 55 different species of mammals, and they covered the full range of body size um, in both primates and carnivorans. We then created 3D computer models of each of the larynges from the CT scan data, which allowed us to carry out detailed measurements of the laryngeal cartilages in a non-destructive, consistent way. All the larynges came from animals that had lived and died in zoos throughout Northern Europe. We then used statistical tools to compare primates and carnivorans and model the evolutionary history of variation in the larynx. And finally, we then compared larynx size with species typical call frequency data using a database of animal sound recordings. Our results highlight a very clear pattern. Relative to carnivoran larynges, primate larynges are significantly larger with respect to body size, more variable in size, and have evolved faster. Furthermore, this pattern is strongly related to acoustic variation in the mean frequency of species typical vocalizations. These results imply fundamental differences between primates and carnivorans in the balance of evolutionary forces that constrain larynx size, and they highlight uh, a flexibility amongst primates that may help explain why we and other species have developed complex and diverse uses of the vocal organ for the purposes of communication.